Hi, welcome to Coding Manasa channel. Uh, in today's video, we will see how do you code obstetric and gynecology CPT coding. Okay, uh, what do you mean by obstetric and gynecology? Obstetric means treating a pregnant lady, uh, whereas gynecology means treating female genital problems or diseased conditions. Uh, it's said to be gynecology. So, uh, first you should know three terms prepartum or antepartum partum that is uh, delivery then postpartum partum is childbirth remember prepartum is before childbirth okay that is uh, before childbirth that period is said to be from day one of conception till day of delivery this period is said to be antepartum or prepartum then on delivery it is uh, partum then after delivery till 42 days from the uh, the next day of delivery till 42 days it is said to be postpartum accordingly we have cpt separate separate cpt course and uh, you should know that if a patient is obstetric that means she or uh, she is pregnant and we have to uh, assign o codes as primary in icd 10 cm followed by the complication or diseased condition of the patient okay as secondary diagnosis Okay, now let us see some slides, uh, okay, on uh, uh, this CPT coding guidelines, 2021. So, this slide shows uh, three parts of the obstetric care, antepartum delivery services and postpartum care and two types of OB coding. Uh, includes global OB and non-global OB or partial services. Let us understand what is the difference between them. 59400, 59510. Okay, one is antepartum, vaginal, and postpartum care, whereas 59510 is antepartum care, cesarean delivery, and postpartum care. That is routine obstetric care. Whereas 59610 is routine obstetric care, including antepartum care, vaginal delivery, and postpartum care after previous cesarean delivery. That means second time patient is coming for delivery. If vaginal delivery is done, uh, she has a previous uh, cesarean delivery, then we uh, report with this CPT. Whereas uh, Finance 618 is routine rest obstetric care including antepartum care, cesarean delivery, postpartum care after uh, previous cesarean delivery. This slide shows services included in global obstetrical package. When you report the previous uh, told uh, 50,000 series uh, CPTs, all these services are bundled in them. See routine prenatal visits until delivery after first three antepartum visits, recording of weight, blood pressures and fetal heart tones, admission to the hospital including history and physical. Inpatient EM service provided in 24 hours of delivery, management of uncomplicated labor, vaginal or cesarean section delivery, delivery of placenta, administration of IV, oxytocin, insertion of cervical dilator on the same day of delivery. Repair of first or second degree lacerations, removal of cerclage, not under anesthesia, and complicated inpatient visits following delivery. Routine outpatient EM services provided within 42 days after following delivery, postpartum care after delivery. They are included uh, in the global CPT code and should not be separately coded. If suppose during delivery there is third or fourth degree lacerations, then uh, we should append modified 22 to the uh, uh, global OB code and build a claim. We have seen services included in OB package. Now these are the services excluded from global OB package. See, first three antepartum visits, lab tests, fetal tests, echographies, and amniocentesis, amniofusion, uh, CVS, okay, non-stress test, stress test, external cephalic version. All these are uh, excluded and should be separately reported. This slide shows uh, delivery services only. Uh, it means our surgeon is doing only delivery. Uh, if it is vaginal delivery, 59409. If it is only cesarean delivery, 59514. 59612 is vaginal delivery after previous cesarean delivery. 59620 is cesarean delivery following attempted vaginal delivery after previous cesarean delivery. In the previous slide, we have seen only delivery services. Here, in this slide, it shows codes uh, delivery only including postpartum care. 59410, 59515, 59614 and 59622. These codes mean that uh, our surgeon is doing delivery along with postpartum care of the patient. If our doctor is only seeing postpartum care, then it is 59430. That is a code to be coded. Okay. 
so that's all for today in my next video i'll come up with another topic i uh, hope you uh, this cleared the uh, doubts on obstetric and gynecology if you have any queries you can write in the uh, comment section uh, thank you so much